हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज अर्जुना एंड वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल द साइंस हाउलर्स सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अ वेरी न्यू टॉपिक व्हिच इज क्लाउड कंप्यूटिंग नाउ क्लाउड कंप्यूटिंग इज अ टर्म व्हिच इज जनरली यूज्ड इन कंप्यूटर साइंस सो विदाउट एनी फर्दर अडू लेट्स स्टार्ट अ टुडेस वीडियो topics we are going to cover in our today's video first comes what is cloud computing second why do we need cloud computing third types of cloud computing we also call it as deployment models and at last we are going to learn cloud providers the people who provide us with cloud so first let us learn what is cloud computing so cloud computing is basically a type of server which is online and it provides us with storage then it provides us with software networking and many other features this is very much helpful for office workers and the students like me because if we have to access some application we can easily access we do not have to go to schools and then take the uh, files from the computer and then bring it home insert in the computers this is a very long process but we have invented a such a way in which there is a type of server which is online it is type of a cloud which is above us and all can see it and we can easily access these files which are present in the cloud and it is not necessary that uh, we should ne uh, be near the school or we should be near that particular computer we just have to upload that particular file on that cloud and we can easily access that file from any part of the world Yes friends you heard me right from any part of the world literally if you want to access the server of india and you are uh, in america you can easily access the server and in a most simpler terms we can see a group of people have made a server and its accessibility has been given to all now a person who wants to use that particular feature he has to send a request to the owner of that server and if the owner agrees then he will allow the accessibility of that server so he can use that server now let's see one day to day life example in which the cloud computing is applied now earlier when we went to schools or we went to some offices or some type of work we had to uh, give test or fill the forms physically but now due to corona pandemic all these things are online so the platforms like google forms help us in doing these things now when we have to give a test what we have to do is fill the details and give the test and submit that google form and when we click on the submit button it automatically gets added into the cloud which is private now we are going to learn about private clouds and different types of cloud in the second part of the video now when this gets added on to the cloud the teacher can easily access these files and can give us grades now comes the second topic which is why do we need cloud computing now uh, when this cloud computing came into market it proved very successful because it made the uh, work of the people very much easy faster and it was too easily accessible for all now uh, before this is also an example before we, uh, if we had to access some applications from the school server what we had to do is connect to the lan cables now lan cable means local area network cables or we had to connect to the same internet which is used by the server of that school but at that time it was not possible and in this corona pandemic it is truly not possible to do so so we use cloud computing we just have to uh, put that uh, particular application or file onto the cloud and we can easily access it from any part of the world so here as you saw that the cloud computing came into action and it helped us a lot 
now one more big difference before and now is that when the cloud computing was not there and if a person had to host a server he had to buy many application and it was too costly at that time and the prices were at peak so it was not affordable for all but when the cloud computing came into market we just have to pay a little amount of money and we can use those particular features one more very big difference before and now is that before when cloud computing was not there and we bought many applications which was too costly at that time as i have said there were some unnecessary features which we do not need for hosting that server so it was little bit waste of money but now as cloud computing has came there is less expenditure and more profit and in simpler terms we just have to pay little amount of money and we get more performance so friends this was the end of the video if you like our video please like it share it and do subscribe it and hit the bell icon now we are going to cover the other two topics in the part 2 video and this part 2 video would be out soon also follow us on our instagram and facebook account link to it is in the description now we will meet each other in the next video which will be the part 2 video of cloud computing so till then bye bye friends take care of yourself and remember when science howlers is here no need to fear